Hello everyone, each and every time, whenever anyone ping me for WhatsApp Cloud API project, I usually send this document. So it will give the understanding about how do we work with the client. So in this video, I will go through this document and give you the basic understanding. So whenever I need to refer any kind of document or documentation, I use this AI tool to create the mind map. So it will make my work easy as that. Just go to the mind map AI dot app and I just click the sign up. I just click login with Google. In the home page they have provided some of the example but what i'm going to do is i'm going to the google doc and i just click the files and i just click download and download as a pdf so i just click the attach file and i click this one this document i just click open file has been uploaded create it and i just click it's created a mind map i just close this one by default this is choosing this view i just click this right side view so this is a mind map for the previously uploaded document. So I'm going to arrange this one. So first I'm going to choose the client meeting and right click and move up. Again, I just click move up. So I have arranged the notes based on the, the working, working order. order. So we set up the meeting with the clients to gather the requirements. So once the requirement is done, so we are creating the user journey diagram. For this use case, we use the razor.io. So let's say an example, whenever any of the clients send a message to our WhatsApp board. So we are listing some of the items. This is specially for the food ordering. So in case if they choose the cakes or pizza order, then we will list that another question, what will you like to get? So custom design cake, butter cakes. So in case if they choose the first option, so likewise we will gather the all the requirement and present this kind of diagram to the client so once client approve the diagram so let's say i will add the note once we get the approval from the client we will do the working hours estimation so once we done the working hours estimation so let's say this is taking 10 hours then our hourly rate is 25 dollars so the budget calculation should be 250 dollars so we will bring the 50 percentage advance 125 dollars advance so once we bring the advance from the client we start to working on the business verification so in order to get the business verification we have to do this kind of things so let's ai summarize this thing so it is generating and summarizing this business verification so meta verification needs website email policies and tax infos if you don't know how to get the business verification from the meta Please make sure to watch this video getting verified on whatsapp business platform so once the verification is done we need a dedicated phone number if we want to build any of the production ready application in whatsapp cloud api we need to bring the whatsapp phone number because if you're creating any of the flows that is belong to that phone number so in case if you're creating any of the flows in the test number that flow is belong to that test number so that's why we bring the bots phone number so this is the production deployment requirement and the last one so once we got the phone number and start to building any of the application first we need to obtain a token with the two permission so let me add a child add another child to obtain a token with these two permission business management and business messaging so once we obtain a token we can able to work with the whatsapp cloud apis and follows then we can able to hand over this project to the client so this is how we work with any of the client so if you want to build any kind of application in whatsapp cloud api just email your requirement to developers at nothingapps.com and that's all guys if you like this video please make sure to subscribe and hit a like and thank you so much mm -hmm.